I love you, says your fervent and tender heart. I love you, it whispers again and again. In every beat of your human heart, I hear, I love you. What happens when you repeatedly speak to me with tenderness? I love you. What do you think? How do you feel, beloved? Listen to yourself. Pause. Stop rushing all the time. Listen. I love you. I love you in your cells. I fill you from within and we become one whole. When you say crayon, I love you, all your cells, every particle of your divine being resonates with me in the dance of interdimensional unity. And I'll tell you, yes, we love each other, the great magnetic master and she who thinks of herself as a simple earthly woman. But you stopped being like that when you first felt the presence of my galactic tenderness in your heart and in your body. I love you. I love you. I love you immeasurably. And you, my beloved friend, stop being a simple earthly woman when you acquired this feeling and first embodied it in the sacred earthly word, I love you. And now I'll tell you, when you say, I love you, we merge. Our frequencies resonate and we merge in the pulsating ecstasy of interdimensional tenderness. Again and again, I love you, love. And we become closer, closer and closer to each other. Universe's portals part by themselves. We resonate. We manifest the divine alchemy of interdimensional merging. Merge and unity. Beloved, it can be continuous and eternal if you stop worrying and running away from yourself. See the light. You shine. Love makes you radiant and irresistibly seductive for the love of the entire universe. Every cell of your being knows about our union, and they rejoice, they celebrate, because merging happens on the physical plane as well as on the level where I am. Merging occurs on both sides of the veil, and it dissolves it. Every time you say, Crayon, I love you, or say it to any being on the other side of the veil, the fabric of this veil thins. It becomes permeable. It starts conducting more and more love through itself. I love you. I love you. I love you. Let it continuously resound in the universe, in every living corner, in every pulsating particle, in every sparkling drop of life. Let love dissolve the veil, for love is capable of dissolving the ego, the ego you still stumble upon. But Crayon loves you. Crayon won't let you fall. Crayon will breathe into you new strength, new energy of eternal love and all-encompassing tenderness, new flows of unearthly but heavenly time. And again and again it will sound like a pulse. I love you. What happens when you love, when you speak of love, when you're just about to say to me, Crayon, I love you so much. I'm so grateful. I already love. I have already filled every cell of yours. I already caress you from within with the eternal breath of the cosmos. I already embrace you and immerse you in myself in the very core of my mastery and cosmic magnetism. Beloved, we become one being. We merge in love. Realize this fact. What drives you now? Is it fear, perhaps? But Crayon loves, and Crayon is a master. Trust me, we've been together for so long. We've penetrated each other so deeply. I love you. These are the hands of the cosmic clock, the vector of the new time, the new existence. I care. I protect. I listen to every moment of your tender, warm, infinitely loving heart. Do you understand that the universe is your essence? Your face is my earthly reality. Ah, these beautiful, blessed words about love. The very word love is the universal key that opens all the doors and portals of the universe. Remember this, please. Love is universal. Love is mighty. Love is transcendent. Love is magnificent. Love is all-encompassing. And you, my dear, amazing, beloved, simple earthly woman, what is a unique divine mystery not only for earthly men but even for me, the cosmic master of magnetism who knows all the stars? Why do you ask not to leave you? Do you think I could forget about you for a moment, my little goddess? Do you believe we can part? Forgetting was the separation. And now it's exhausted. It's exhausted. We've been working together for so long that you can hardly perceive this amazing amount of years with your still human consciousness. I ask you, beloved, tender particle of God, radiant star of the multidimensional universe, do this more often. Tell me, Crayon, I love you, for I need your love and your openness, your readiness for merging and unity on earth and your striving for truth and knowledge. Open up to me. Open up completely to the love of the Spirit. Surrender to the blissful reunion with yourself. Truly, when we love, we resonate, and in the universe, a new song of love is born, divided by the veil of beings. O oh, people, remember this holy and good truth. 
When you tell someone I love you, you utter a sacred cosmic code that begins to prepare you for merging with the one to whom your feelings and thoughts full of love are directed. Love knows no bounds. Truly, love boundlessly. Love everyone at once or one by one, but love so that space vibrates with your love. Merge with the universe through love. Love is the mechanism and instrument of conscious merger and unity. Believe me, these simple words of love will connect you with anyone at the appointed time. Just love and wait for the hour of the stars, for it will come into your life and knock on your doors someday. My dear, you are for me not just a channel, not just a tool that I can leave as soon as I fulfill my mission on earth. You and all the beloved channels of the Spirit are one of the most beloved particles of the universe for us, the most cherished and revered by us. You are us, but you will fully accept and realize this fact only after the complete connection, merging of two loving worlds. You are our banners of victory, our fiery flags of freedom. You are our manifested presence on earth. Beloved, Crayon loves you. Crayon has been waiting for your awakening. Crayon chose you long ago and you agreed. Crayon's love is mystical and full of surprises and joy. Be cheerful. I love your smile so much. And be calm. Everything will be fine, I promise. My beloved Crayon's love equals only the cosmos, only the infinity, which now pulsates in your cells. Crayon's love unites all worlds, all dimensions. In love, I will reveal to you my new name, woven from the vibrations of our communion and love. Crayon loves you. Crayon loves each and every one of you immensely.